Hey guys, John Hammond here, still looking at PKCTF 2017. So this challenge coming up next is called Little School Bus. It says, can you help me find the data in this littleschoolbus.bmp, so bitmap. Um, the nod here and kind of the, the hint and guidance is that this is Little School Bus or LSB. So that acronym you will hear a lot in forensics and kind of the umbrella of that or underneath that is steganography, trying to hide data and other data, trying to mask and obscure things that you want to keep secret. So even that checking out the hint here, that LSB means least significant bit or, or trying to hide other data in the very, very last bit of every single byte of something. So this happens a lot in music or in images where they'll tweak just the very, very last bit or like the zero or the one at the end of every, very, every byte in a picture and put all together all of those bits, the very last one in a line or something, that will have a special message or a special thing. So you can do a whole lot of research on this. If you want to look up least significant bit steganography, it's all over the internet. Um, it explains it a lot for one thing, but you want an interesting thing, steganography. Because you're trying to figure out, okay, how can I actually get this, um, this, these bits out, and how do, I, how do I actually uncover the data that people are trying to hide in here? So there are tools that allow you to do this. Um, a lot of things are different because they may be trying to hide something in the image, for one thing. Um, they may be trying to hide text, etc. So some of the online tools may just give you... Um, an online image thing that they're trying to detect. So let me go ahead and copy this. We can, we, I can show it to you in action rather than just trying to talk about it. Make directory little school bus. W get this guy. Cool. Let's upload him. Try and unhide or something in here. That should be uploaded now. So even if we were checking out with this tool, there's nothing that we're going to particularly get out of this. It's not showing us least significant bit-wise for, for text or something that we're trying to get out of it. So this tool doesn't help us. We may be able to find other tools and stuff for that, but one that I've seen that works exceptionally well is called ZSteg, and that's to find hidden images or hidden information, hidden data in specifically PNG, Portable Network Graphics, or Bitmap. Um, Images. So it requires Ruby. It's written in Ruby, so you need to use Gem to install it. Uh, so sudo apt install Gem if you don't have that Ruby package manager, kind of like pip from Python. Uh, and you can Gem install ZSteg. And then there are some options you can give it, but it will go ahead and like rip out any text that it finds if it finds text written or, or pieced together in the file that you give it. So I have it installed already. I won't showcase going to install it, but I can if you need to. It, I think, does trip up some people when you're trying to go ahead and get gem ready, but it's well worth it if we, once you get ZStag set up. So you can run it, and it will just crank through the entire like picture, and it will rip out the flag just like that. ZStag is, is awesome when you have an LSB, your least significant bit challenge. So let's keep that in mind as a flag. So that is honestly all I kind of wanted to showcase for that challenge. Um, I would point you towards your own research if you want to learn more about least significant bit, but I would advocate that that ZSteg tool is awesome for when you see that challenge. Um, it will just kind of parse out any text or whatever it can find in just those bits that are defined as, okay, something that may be manipulated to hide data, but it's one cool trick. So. Now I want to give a shout out to the people that support me on Patreon. So all of these individuals, you are the best. Thank you so much for being awesome <laughs> and being willing to do what you do. Uh, I appreciate um, all your support. $1 a month on Patreon will give you a special shout out at the end of every video just like this. Um, $5 a month will give you early access to everything I create on YouTube before it gets released because uh, I tend to re record in bulk or in mass and then I'll gradually have YouTube just release it day by day or whatever the case may be. So, hey, if you did like this video, please do leave me a like, maybe comment, maybe subscribe if you're willing. And if you want to support me, check me out on Patreon or my website, www.johnhammond.org. Thanks.